the stores over there and don't get cute. Blue Rose of Healy. What do you want? Sorry, sorry, that damn Krogan's love poems are getting on my nerves. Is that Krogan bothering you? No, no, you don't need to hurt him or anything. Oh, He's harmless. Which, I know, Krogan, Let so it's hard to believe. His name is Char. Of we're of kind of Char. dating, but, well, we're on a break. And he's trying to show me how sensitive he is by, well, wooing me. It's really bad. Why are the two of you on a break? He's serious. Serious, as in talking about kids. Char is a great guy to date, but for something permanent... Krogans live long lives. It's not like dating a human where you just stick it out for a century till they die. Uh, no offense. It made me wonder if he really likes me. Or if he just wants kids, he can't have them any other way, you know. Because of the genophage. You, have blossomed you need to talk to your boyfriend. He's just gonna keep shouting poetry until you do. I know, but it's tough. I like him a lot. Hell, I love him. But I don't know if he's permanent bond material. Look at him. He's obviously crazy about you. Is he? I mean... What if he just wants to have kids? Am I just his baby-making machine? He said I wasn't, but... If he said that, then you either trust him, so you have nothing to worry about, or you don't, and you've already decided. I... I guess I hadn't thought about it like that. And I do trust him, if he said it. I'm going to talk to him. Here, I've given you a discount at the terminal. Thanks for the help. Looking for weapons. No, she won't even talk to me. No, she really has it in for humans. I might explain the damn contract. Welcome to Baria Frontiers. Our sales kiosk is over there. Welcome to Baria Frontiers. Can I help you with something? I'm looking for an Asari warrior named Samara. Wait, why? Do you have a problem, or... Did she kill somebody already? Relax. I just need to speak with her. Good. Samara's the first Justicar I've seen on Ilium. If I'm lucky, things will stay peaceful. She went to the commercial spaceport a few hours ago. If you want to get there, the pedestal on that balcony will summon a cab. Just be polite when you meet her. Justicars embody our highest laws, and they usually stay in Asari space. She's not used to dealing with aliens. I'm looking for Samara. 
Like I said, she's at the commercial spaceport. You can hail a cab at the pedestal on that balcony over there. Thanks for your help. Good luck with the Justicar. Try not to piss her off. You're Shepard? I don't know if you remember me. I was a colonist at Zoo's Hope on Pharos. You saved us from that enormous Geth attack, and from the Thorian creature's control. After you killed the Thorian, we rebuilt. Zoo's Hope is beautiful now, and we owe it all to you. How are the colonists doing? We're doing really well. Things are looking even better than they did before the Geth showed up. Exogeny pretty much left us alone. They just left with every bit of Thorian goop they could find. What brings you to Alien? We've had health trouble, probably because of how the Thorian controlled us. We got a deal on some medical tests from a colonial survey group. But the contract had fine print that lets them perform more invasive procedures without our consent. I've talked to the representative, but she won't listen. I think she has a problem with humans. I'll talk to the survey group. Really? Thanks. The sales rep is at the Baria Frontiers kiosk. I saw your conversation, human. You're here to complain about the medical contracts those colonists from Pharaoh signed. I suggest you leave. Your life is short enough. Do not waste what time you have bothering me. Why are you insisting on these tests? What use could they possibly be? Their use is not your concern. A legal binding contract was signed. Nothing else matters. All of you. Humans. Salarians. Turians. You come to our planet, then complain that our laws don't suit you. The galaxy would be a better place if nobody but the Asari had ever dragged themselves out of the primordial muck. Why are you so prejudiced against aliens? Phew, where do I begin? With Salarian explorers unleashing the Rachni upon us, then unleashing the Krogan to correct their mistake? Or the Turians, so eager to bomb every problem away? Or humans, the new arrivals who already think they should be in charge? Every war that has plagued this galaxy has been caused by your people. My people's deaths are on your hands. Whose deaths are we talking about exactly? The mother of my daughters was killed on the Quarian homeworld during the initial Geth uprising. My daughters died on the Citadel when the Geth attacked. One worked in the embassy. The other was a greeter for the consort. I'm not speaking in hypotheticals, human. The aliens will never be my allies. The best they can do is give me useful medical data. Why was your bond made on the Quarian homeworld? Studying the Quarians. Not their technology, but their music. She loved all their art. Said they had old souls. I think that's where my daughters got it from. Both of them love talking with people, exploring new cultures. They sound like wonderful people. The galaxy is lesser for their loss. Yes, it is. Do you think they'd want you to do this? I I'm not. I, I didn't... There's enough grief in this galaxy. I don't need to add to it. 